Hi, my name is Lavish Kumar. In this video, we will learn about dropshipping in Knob Commerce. For this tutorial, we are using version 4.2. So, dropshipping is a popular model that lets you sell products by using supplier that holds the inventory and ships the product for you. So, one of the main advantage of dropshipping is that you don't have to hold any inventory or ship item yourself. This model can help store owners in cutting the cost and liabilities of stocking the merchandise themselves. The best part of this model is that local suppliers become completely invisible. Your customer will receive the item as it was directly shipped by you. So like the question comes, how dropshipping works in op commerce? So when an order is placed, an email is sent to the vendor of each product in that order. So the email includes the product, the quantities, all the information that a vendor needs to know. And the vendor ships the item to the customer on behalf of the merchant. So for an instance, if you're selling a product on your site and you have a vendor for that product, that vendor will be responsible for shipping that item for you. And you don't have to worry about anything in terms of shipping and delivery of the items. Products from multiple independent vendors will basically appear in the common product catalog on your site. So all the products that you can you see here, your customer will be looking at these products and buying from you and you could be selling these products from all your vendors and your vendor will be responsible for shipping these products to your customers. Each vendor could be provided with an administration panel in OpCommerce as well where they can manage their products, review sales report and order details, etc. So let's take a look at how you can manage vendors and drop shipping in op commerce so for this example we'll go to administration section of op commerce and if you go to configuration settings and right here you can see there are vendor settings and here you can manage all the vendor settings how you want information to be handled on your op commerce site for vendors for an instance you can show vendor name on the order detail page you don't have to enable this option so there are a lot of different options that you can play around with to see how your NOP Commerce allows you to work with vendors. To set up a vendor account when you have different vendors on your NOP Commerce, all you have to do is go to Customers and Vendors. So here you can see I have two test vendors account on my NOP Commerce site. So I can click on Edit. And you can see here no customer account associated with this vendor because this is a test account. So all you have to do is you have to associate a customer account with the vendor account. So go to customers and pick a customer account that relates to the vendor account. So in this case, let's take an example, this James Pan. So we will associate this customer account with the vendor account. So I'll click on the edit. In this example, I'm going to completely show you from start to finish how you can set up and use drop shipping on your op commerce site. So all you have to do is assign a vendor role to the customer and assign your vendor name. So for an instance, if you have actual vendors, you'll have a name, vendor one, vendor two, whatever the name of your vendor is. So in this case, I have associated vendor one with this record. Okay. Now that our vendor has been set up successfully on knob commerce site let's act as a customer and go to public store and let's try to order an item but one thing to remember we haven't associated a product for the vendor to do that we'll go to the administration section i'll go to the catalog and products because right now we have only set up a vendor account that doesn't mean necessarily means that vendor may have any products on the knob commerce account. So you may have to associate those products with the vendor. So I'll click on the edit option. And again, this is just an example. When you have actual vendors and you give them the ability to log into your knob commerce site as a vendor account, they'll be able to add more products to your site so you don't have to worry about adding or managing these products 
So all you have to do is scroll down and render one. So here you can see I have this shoe product and let's take a look at the inventory in this case. So I have inventory 10,000. Think of it as an example where you have a product and you have to maintain 10,000 stock inventory for this product. This can be a lot of overhead cost. So all you have to do is work with the vendor, have a product added on your NopCommerce site that is provided by the vendor and let the vendor ship the product for you, for you. So now, if I'm acting as a customer, I will go to product catalog. I will pick a product here. So remember, this is the product that we associated with the vendor. So acting as a customer, I will simply place an order for this item. I will go to shopping cart. I will just remove this product for the time being. Okay, so I got this product in my cart and I will check out. And I'll. And again, the shipping, everything works depending on the address of the customer. So a customer will pay the shipping cost if there's any applicable costs associated with the product. Continue and confirm. Perfect. Now that I have placed an order, now an email will be received by the vendor automatically from the NopCommerce site and they'll be able to access the site and they'll be able to see the order details and ship the product. So in this example, I have a test account. So I'm going to, let's say, I'm now I'm going to act as a vendor and I'm going to log in. And remember, this is the customer account that we associated with the vendor. Now I'll go to login. And you can see here, now as a vendor, I'm able to see the administration section of NopCommerce site. But when you actually go there, you can see it's a very secure way of giving access to the vendors. They're not able to see any other thing, anything other than their catalog where they can manage their products and the order. So remember, we associated this product with this vendor, so they can only see this product, and they can always add more products, so you don't even have to worry about adding products on their behalf. A vendor can manage all the products themselves. So you can see here, stock quantity is one less than 10,000, because one order was placed. So all they have to do is go to sales, orders, and you can see here, my order is showing up here. If I go to edit, I can see all the detail, billing, shipping address, and where they have to ship. So once the vendor is ready to ship the item, all they have to do is add the shipment information and they'll be able to ship the item directly to the customer on the behalf of you as a business owner. So this is really easy for a business owner to run an online business without worrying about shipping the items to the customer. So this is how you can manage drop shipping in NopCommerce site. Now it's time for us to wrap up this tutorial video. Hope this was helpful. This video is brought to you by NopCommerce, open source shopping cart. Thank you.